Hey guys, looking to replace second floor AC system. So we got an air conditioner up on our roof here. It's not a very tall roof. The roof's about 10 feet tall. So we got three quarter by three eighths lines. We're gonna flush out. New disconnect, new whip. Uh, we are in Clayton, so we're gonna need the hurricane pad to go down. The other option we're gonna look into is possibly going back down where our ladder is for the air conditioner. So we'll take our refrigerant lines and then we'll extend them down low, just kind of like they did with the electric. You can see with the electric, they just ran down by the gutter. That electric has ran over to where there's other electric box over there. So the electric will probably be able to go away, as far as what I can tell. And we'll just extend our refrigerant lines down. And we can set our air conditioner down there somewhere around the unit. All right, guys, here's our indoor section. So air handler in place. Flush the lines out. The drain goes here, but this is one of the reasons we're here. That drain leaks underneath the bathtub. So we're going to need to put a cap on that, and we're going to run a drain a different way. Uh, depending on what the homeowner decides, it may have it in a different video. And then you can set it back on the the box here, but we're going to need to make sure you put the safety switches. The inline drain one, and I may put a, um, we may make an access hole here so that we can put a uh, safety switch underneath it.